Praise the Lord, everybody. I just wanted to come on for a few minutes today to talk to you about don't let whatever it is keep you from reaching Jesus. Our scripture reference is coming from Mark 5, 33 and 34. And I'll read it for your hearing. Then the woman, knowing what had happened to her, came and fell at his feet and trembling with fear, told him the whole truth. He said to her, daughter, your faith has healed you. Go in peace and be freed from your suffering. Amen. Now, in these particular scriptures, it gives reference to a woman who has an issue uh, with a blood flow for 12 years. God bless her heart. She really suffered and she became desperate. She came out in the crowd knowing that in those days you were supposed to stay in the house. And you were considered unclean around that time of the month. However, she pressed her way through. The Bible says that she touched Jesus' garment and immediately she was made whole. She was healed. Then Jesus turned around and said, somebody touch me. Hallelujah. The disciples said, <laughs> with sarcasm, there is a crowd of people and you ask who touched you? He asked because power had gone out of him and healed her. It was her faith that made her whole. You see, it's your faith that can heal you. It's your faith that can deliver you. It's your faith that can get your prayers answered. Hallelujah. It's your faith that can get you the help that you need. Whatever you are going through, if you could just have faith that Jesus can work it out, he will. No matter how big your problem is, nothing, and I mean nothing, is too big for God. Hallelujah. I pray about everything, and then I believe him to do what I ask according to his will. You have not because you ask not. Jesus told her, daughter, mm, term of endearment, daughter. He said that because that's what we are to him. We are his daughters and we are his sons as well. But your faith had made you well. And that's what he said to her. Daughter, your faith had made you well. It was her faith, y'all. I'm telling you. It's your faith. I'm if you got faith, he said as little as a mustard seed. Then he told her, go in peace and be healed of your affliction. Get close to Jesus and trust him. Don't be afraid to ask him for what you need. You are only here for a specific amount of time. You want to live a life that is blessed and a life where you are healthy and prosperous in Jesus name. So with that being said, just know that God loves you and that I love you. And if you need prayer, just let me know and I'll talk to you later. Bye.